What's up everybody, welcome back to Selenix Crypto, hope you're all doing great and welcome to your daily Dogecoin update, of course. Um, wanted to do a quick update, I mean, uh, well, in, in general we, we made the, uh, we made the um, promise that I would do daily updates on Dogecoin, so that's obviously the number one reason why I'm, why I'm covering it right here. But in general, it's, it's also, at this point of time, we're at a pretty crucial level, right? So, so what we talked about yesterday, and we've been talking about this for a week almost, um, is that the main level to break was this level right here between 19 and 20 cents. And then in that level, there's a ton of smaller key levels, which we can break above and break below, etc. Um, but yesterday, we actually got the breakout above that level. Even the, the, the three-day candle right here closed above 20 cents. So that's super bullish. But what we saw over the course of the last, uh, well, what is it? Like, like the last 16 hours or so, um, Bitcoin started to be relatively bearish. And if there's one thing I told you all along when, when talking about Dogecoin is that its, its success really depends a lot on what Bitcoin does. Um, so right now you can also see that technically Dogecoin is trying to hold its most important level, which to make it easier is the middle of 20 and, and 19 cents, so 19 and a half cents. Um, so, so that's why right now we're actually at a, at a, at a, at a pre pretty crucial level. Now, purely technically at this point of time, Dogecoin is still super bullish. And honestly, I am still bullish on Dogecoin. All right. I think, uh, look, it's, it's, it's difficult to say because if Bitcoin really continues this bearish momentum um, over the course of today and tomorrow, so Bitcoin, Bitcoin starts dropping down lower than, than 70,000, then Dogecoin is going to break down below again. All right. It's going to have a bearish breakout and then we will um, get into some sort of a weird consolidation. And I was wrong. So you should know that, all right? You should definitely know that even though I think we are still bullish on Dogecoin, I could be wrong, all right? And my analysis could be wrong. I could be having the, the, the key levels wrong. That's all possible. Uh, but if you look at Dogecoin overall right here, look, the structure right here is bullish. We gained a ton of open interest right here and sure that that's dropping down, but at these levels that it has dropped down a little bit, the momentum, it's too early to say that it's, that it's over. We still technically have had a ma massive bullish breakout. We are reacting very positively to the level we broke above. Bitcoin is reacting very positively to strong support right here between the 28 and the 382, uh, 28 EMA and the 382 FIB. So there's no reason for me to believe yet that we will not be bullish, right? If you, if, if you understand. Um, so those are my thoughts. I think, we will, I, I think we will hold this level, reclaim 20 cents, and that will slowly get up to, well, let's stay conservative, 22 and a half cents as the first price target. That's what I expect. I, I think that's still in line with the technical structure right here. Um, I think that's in line with where Bitcoin is going. So I have to say that I think that's most likely. Now, if I see, and, and like I said, I'll, I'll keep you updated on this. But if I see that Dogecoin is not able to reclaim 20, 20 cents, for example, so if we're not able to break above that, or if I see that uh, that Dogecoin right here breaks down below 19 cents and really gets a, a bearish breakout on a four hour time frame, those are all indications that I was wrong and that Dogecoin is actually more bearish than I expected. Um, but that's something we'll see over the course of today. And like I said, with the open interest increases we, we saw over the last over the last week, even or the last couple of days, I would say, um, and the and the strength that that Bitcoin is showing at this 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 morning. I would still say this is most likely. So that's what, what I'm going to tell you. But those are my thoughts. That's what I think you need to know for now. If you do have any questions, of course, let me know down in the comments. Uh, for now, thank you for watching. Have a great day. Stay safe with training the Dogecoin either way. Um, but thank you for watching and bye.